Hey what's up guys and welcome back to a brand new video on the channel today. Today guys we have episode number 8 of the Newcastle Financial Takeover Career Mode in FIFA 20. Thank you guys for the support on the previous episode as always it is greatly appreciated. Make sure to hit the like button, comment your thoughts and opinions on the video down below in the comment section for today and to subscribe if you're new around here. Um, we're slowly creeping up to 1.7k subs which is great to see. Um, so today's episode, before I do get into the first game against Leicester, as you did see there. So, like I said, Leicester, first day of January, which is another thing to mention. January, obviously the January transfer window is open until the 31st. Um, we only have about 5 million or 5.5 million to spend, but I could sell some players. Um, I think there's a couple of centre-backs which we've got, like we've got too many centre-backs, so I might sell someone on. Um, so maybe I might sell some players on. If we get a big bid for a player, I might sell them on. Um, but do let me know in the comment section down below if there are any transfer suggestions for around maybe the obviously like from what we've got from, from anywhere from zero all the way up to around let's say 20 million because I might sell some players um, so 20 to 25 million um, or zero to 25 million should I say uh, roughly for the budget and um, in terms of this month so what we're going to do today play Leicester then we've got the FA Cup round of 64 against West Brom uh, which hopefully we can win. Hopefully we can go on a little cup run there. Then we've got Wolves. Then a week later we've got Chelsea. Then a couple of days later we've got Everton. Um, I think for this episode I'm probably just going to focus on this month. Uh, get to the January transfer window. Um, or I'll probably get to Everton. Then stop. Fi uh, finish the video. And then let you guys comment your transfer suggestions. And then hopefully we can maybe get an, a new addition to the team in January. If not... Um, Oh, I'll, I'll probably do that anyway, and then the next month will probably be uh, the next episode. Sorry, will be this month, and then probably th this month as well, uh, March. So uh, we're coming into the back end of the season. Obviously, January is the busiest month out of the remaining months, apart from April or May, I do believe. Um, but anyway, we're just going to get straight into it today, as always. Uh, jumping in with the first game against Leicester. Right then, guys, moving on into the first game of the episode against Leicester at home. Big game. Obviously, we have bumped up to Legendary now, uh, just because it was getting too easy, like I did mention in the previous episode. And as you did see, we did struggle against um, United and also Everton. Well, we didn't struggle. We just lost the games. Um, we could have easily beat Everton. Um, but like I said, uh, we've changed the difficulty just to give us a bit more of a challenge. Oh, that's not a good play from Martinez. But anyway, uh, we're going to see how we get on in this game against Leicester. Hopefully, we can... Uh, Bounce back from the previous two games and uh, hopefully we can get a win. But starting off, Harvey Barnes is absolutely tearing it down this left hand side. Manquillo, De La Vega should have really got that to be fair, and so should have Manquillo. But Somar is there. De La Vega actually can counter attack from the position we just had. Plays it inside. Martinez. Oh, that's a terrible pass. Here come Leicester again with Perez, I do believe. Whips into the back post. Harvey Barnes is there, and it's going to be a corner. Manquillo doing enough there to block the header from Barnes. Barnes. Oh, I should have probably won that ball there. Tielemans. Tielemans again. Whips it into the back post. Danny Rose has to get his head onto that. We can counter-attack here with De La Vega. Almiron. Martinez. That's a cracking ball down to De La Vega. Inside now, Almiron. Ah, oh, we've still got the ball though. Bowden. There's not really much in front of me here. Almiron. Bowden. Alright, play it wide. De La Vega on the ball. Cuts inside. Foden. Ah, oh, that's not a good pass, is it? Vardy now on the ball. Tielemans, Vardy. That's probably going to be 1 0, and it is. Ah, oh, I just couldn't get the ball off them there. Jamie Vardy and Tielemans linking up well there. Again, oh, it's poor defending from me. And we're already 1-0 down. Almiron now into Foden. Going to play it back to Almiron, Martinez. Oh, De La Vega's got a lot of space here. De La Vega cuts it back. Gets the shot away. And it's in. Top corner. De La Vega with the strike. Cutting in on the left foot. And he bangs it. Top corner. What a finish that was, by the way. Cuts inside. Sends both defenders the other way. And straight into that top corner. Literally just before half time. I'm pretty sure it's gonna the ref's gonna blow for half time after the kickoff. Um yeah, literally there we go. Half time one one. Delavega on the ball, he's got a lot of space. Foden's inside. 
I'm going to play it inside to Martinez. Oh, it's Canate though, of all people. You don't really want your centre-back here. But anyway, it doesn't matter because Martinez is in. Can he switch the play? Foden. Yes! 2-1. One, uh, one. Phil Foden getting a goal. As I mentioned in the first half, he hasn't really had a great game or he hasn't really done well in the past few episodes. He's going to bring Shelby on for Samar because he's a bit tired. What a finish that is from Foden. Lovely pass from Latoura Martinez as well. And we're now 2-1 up against Leicester. Martinez now got a bit of space to find someone. Foden's here. He cuts inside, lays it off to Almiron who shoots and it's just wide. Oh, Miguel Almiron. Should have probably got our third there. Almiron now, a bit of space, De La Vega's inside, Martinez turns, oh, he's trying to find St. Maxim on the wing. Oh, here we go, Perez. Uh, I forgot he's playing against his former club, obviously. Oh, is he Perez? Here comes Iheanacho. Shah is pushing him out wide. Tielemans again. Just going to jockey him, don't have to dive in. Oh, Perez has got the ball. And Kilo doesn't get enough off that. Oh my god, what a save from Dubravka. I'm going to bring Atsu on in the middle just to get a bit of fresh legs. Phil Toden is knackered um, in the middle. So we're going to try and defend this corner now. Ball whipped in. Keeper should just catch that. I'm going to try and um, roll this one out here to Almiron. Because, oh, why is he not playing it down to Perez, um, Martinez? Oh, that's a bit annoying. But we've still got the ball though. So it's not too, too bad. Lovely ball into Martinez. De La Vega should be on side. Oh, he's giving the ball away. And here come Leicester now on the counter. And Didi with the ball into Kaputska. Doesn't really know what to do with it here. He's got the ball though. Atsu, watch that inside. Indidi again. Vardy, back to Indidi. Oh, this is dangerous from Leicester. Indidi with the strike and it's well wide. Here comes Jolinton, fresh on the pitch. I did take um, Almiron off because he was absolutely gassed. Uh, so I've just dropped Martinez into the cam roll. We'll play this inside to Martinez. Yulinton's through. Ah, oh, he just couldn't get his first touch right. Pressing the ball now. Yulinton, like I said, fresh on the pitch. Should be uh, able to press that. And again, five minutes left. I don't really want to commit too many men forward. I want to obviously keep this lead. Because this will be a big win for us against Leicester. Strong Leicester side. Who, uh, I'm not too sure where they are on the table, to be quite honest. But, ne nevertheless, nevertheless, um... Right, here we go. Got the ball back. Martinez. Oh, it's a poor touch from him. Martinez. Oh, I can't get there. Butska, Mankilo. Just calm it down. Keep the ball. Martinez. Here's Atsu. He's got a uh, fresh leg, so I can run into a bit of space with him. Yulinton. Hey, and there we go. 2 1 win against Leicester at home. That's a really, really big win for us. And uh, hopefully, we can carry that on into the next game against West Brom. Right then guys, moving on into the second game of the episode. Obviously we're playing against the West Brom side who are in the division below, but an FA Cup, I think it's uh, the third round, I think this is, um, is a big round, is a big tie for us. And like I said at the start of the episode, I wouldn't mind a little cheeky cup run. Uh, obviously we we're not in the Carabao Cup anymore, um, but I have rotated the side pretty heavily, so I'm not too sure how that's going to go in terms of how we play, but... Nevertheless, we do have players that are good enough to be starting for us uh, in this game. So, here we go now, Luka Bakio. Oh, can he find the pass to uh, Bentaleb? Obviously, Bentaleb's someone that's not really featured this much uh, for us this season. Almiron. Almiron's one of the ones that has stayed on the pitch. John Joe Shelby charging through. Still got the ball, Bentaleb. Luka Bakio should whip that one in. Oh, Shelby should have got on the end of that. And here come West Brom. Oh, it's a great chance to go ahead. The switch is on. But Williams, obviously he hasn't featured for us. I kind of didn't really want to play him this season because obviously he got injured in real life. Um, so I was trying to keep it a little bit realistic. But Luca Bacchio has got a lot of space over the back line. And he's going to charge through. He's got the pace. The defender is there. I don't think that's actually going to go out of play. It's not. Luca Bacchio. Ah, oh, free kick in a silly position. But anyway, let's see how we get on. Armour on now. Bit of space for Lazaro on the wing. Going to try and slide that through to Luca Bacchio. Cuts it back. Lovely turn. Can he lay someone off? Miguel Almiron. And it's 1-0 in the 24th minute. Lovely, lovely play from Lazaro and Luca Bacchio down on the right-hand side. Luca Bacchio cuts inside from that pass from Lazaro. Waited a minute. Plays it across to Almiron. First time shot. Bottom corner. You love to see it. 1-0 up against West Brom. 
Here come West Brom on the attack. Robinson whips the ball in. Oh my god, Pereira scored. No, I thought Lazaro was going to get that and he clearly didn't. Pereira running in, unmarked really. Lascelles not really there. Lazaro couldn't get there in time. And it's 1-1 just before half time. Lazaro on the overlap, that's a great pass to Lazaro. And across that one in. Your Linton! Oh my god, what a save from the keeper. The ball's going to stay in play. Almiron. Oh, he's not going to get on the end of that. I can't believe the keeper just saved that. What a save. Uh, I don't want to concede before half time, so please make sure we defend this. Williams. I mean, we've done enough with Lejeune. Ventaleb. Oh, can we play Luca Bacchio in? Yes, we can. One last chance before half time. Luca Bacchio. He's overdone it with the run. That's going to be half time. Linton. Is that two going to get on the end of that? Oh, no. Unfortunately not. Might have to make another sub in a minute. I did bring um, Atsu on for uh, Almiron. Oh, Atsu again, not really um, having an impact since coming on. Here come West Brom. And they're going to be through on goal here. Robinson. We're going to look for the cross. And he does. Lejeune. Oh, Lascelles has to get rid of that. Unfortunate, uh, unfortunate enough. Bentaleb now charging through. Shelby is on the overlap. Your intern, that's not a bad first touch. Oh no, he would have been through on goal there. And here come Newcastle. I might have to take Shelby off, you know. He's on a yellow card. Might um, have to take him off. Anyway, West Brom on the attack. To Maxim. Ball's whipped in. Keeper should get that one. Sweat this across to St. Maxim. Atsu now. Bentaleb. Shelby. Bizarro now. A burst down the line. Yulinton has made a run. Oh, actually, Lazaro has made a perfect overlapping run. Lazaro now. Lazaro crosses it in. Yulinton. Oh, we got a bit lucky, but it doesn't matter. It's 2 1. It's 2 1. Let's go. Let's go. Yulinton getting the goal. We got really lucky there, but I'll take it. So Maxim is dying over on the left hand side. We'll bring him off. And uh, hopefully we can now see this one out. Big goal for us. Here come Newcastle again. Luka Bacchio, lovely run. Lovely surging run. Oh, my God. Oh, I didn't really mean to go to your Linton, but he gets the shot away. It's kind of meant for Atsu or Shelby in the middle there. Going to have a corner now. Whip it in with De La Vega. Lejeune is back stick, and he can't get his header on target. There's only five minutes left of this game. Hopefully we can hold out this lead. De La Vega now, lovely little ball to Yulinton. Luca Bacchio, can he get the shot away? And it's saved by Johnson again. Ball's whipped in by De La Vega. Yulinton is front post, heads it. What a save again from Johnson. He's had a great game today. Atsu cuts it in. Need an option. Ventaleb. Oh, he's trying to play it to Shelby and we've given the ball away. Oh, no. Two added minutes. Williams. Ventaleb, what are you doing? Ref blow the whistle, and that is it. We are through to the next round of the FA Cup. Let's move on into the next game against Wolves. All right then, guys, before we get into the next um, game of the episode, as you can see, Leverkusen have come in with a £15.6 million offer for Lascelles. Now, <clears throat> Lascelles actually doesn't start for us. Um, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to delegate this. Um, oh, wait, no, I've done the wrong thing. Uh, negotiate, sorry, just to see if we can get a bit more money. Now he doesn't, like I said, he doesn't start for us. Um, he's he's like one of the backup centre backs. So what I'm going to try and do, I'm going to try and maybe get 20, 20 million for him. Submit submit that and see what they say to that. Hey, again, they're just going to keep saying that. You know what? I'm just going to reject it. Um, for now. Uh, I'd rather keep Lascelles as a backup than, uh, than sell him. And also, Manquilo is going to uh, Sevilla on a pre-contract. Obviously, his, I guess his contract runs out in the summer. So he has now moved uh, on at the end of the season. Um, so I thought I'd show you those uh, transfer stuff uh, before we move into the next game, which is what we're going to do now. Right then, guys, moving on into the next game of the episode. We're up against Wolves. I think... Um, I looked at the table before, 
and Wolves are two, uh, two or three places above us in the table. So hopefully we can um, cause an upset and push ourselves up the table. Uh, let's see how we get on. Jimenez in the box. Oh, lovely turn. Great save from the Bradford. Get up again. Oh, what is the keeper doing? Why did he take so long to get back up? Great original save. I don't know what I was doing in defence. And Jimenez has scored the rebound. It's already 1-0 to Wolves. Here come Wolves again. Jimenez lays off to Neves. Good save by Dubravka again. Wolves only as far as Doherty. Good tackle from Samar, but we can't get rid of the ball. Oh, it's Danny Rose. Sorry, my, my bad. They both had the red boots on. Canate has to clear that. Delavagan out. Almiron. And wait inside. Lovely bit of play from them. Delavagan out on the ball. That's a foul, surely. How's that not a free kick? And we've still got the ball, Somar. Oh my god. It's at Maxim now. Play that inside. Yeah, that's a good ball. Martinez. Somar's through. Gets the shot away and it's in. It's 1 1. Somar with the goal. What a goal that was indeed. Ball played through from Martinez. Lovely, lovely work from Martinez to hold the ball before playing it through. And Samar, on a tight angle, to be fair to him, running away from goal, pulls it across and it's gone in. It's now 1-1 against Wolves. Here come Wolves again. Jimenez, shots blocked. Podence is offside, but we've got the ball now with Danny Rose. I'm going to bring it up now. Play it inside. Samar is there. Almiron is in a lot of space. So is Martinez. That's not a good pass. We've still got the ball. Don't have to worry about that. Foden now. I'm going to wait for that run of Samar. De La Vega, if you can get inside. Oh, trying to wait for that run inside. But Martinez. Oh, it's Almiron. But, uh, it's half time anyway. It's a maximum. A lot of space. Can he switch the play to De La Vega? That is a cracking ball, by the way. Martinez. Slips in Almiron. Oh, I should have played a Foden in. He was through on goal. I tried to slip it to Martinez instead. And now we're going to get hit on the counter with Jimenez. Tabata on the ball. Trying to chase him down, which we get the ball back. Just about to get it out of our box here. But that doesn't matter because we're on the counter now. Martinez, Almiron. Going to cut it back. Martinez is through on goal. If he can get around Dendonka and he can. Can he get the shot away? It's 2-1. Let's go. The Toro Martinez shrugs off then Donka like he's not even there. Smashes it into the top corner past Patricio. Lovely play from Almiron. We got a bit lucky there with a the touch. Bouncing through to us, but I will take that every day of the week. The Toro Martinez getting another goal. And we're now 2 1 up. Here come Wolves again. Podents now. Good tackle from Shah. Still haven't got the ball back. Got it now. Chipped it over to Martinez. Oh, he's not going to get on the end of that, is he? Here come Wolves. Down the right-hand side. Jimenez. What's he going to do here? Lays it off. What a block that is from um, Konate. Martinez. Or Almiron. Oh, my God. Oh, we got the ball back. Oh, my God. Look how lucky they are. Wolves coming up the pitch. Great tackle from Mankilo. Here comes Almiron now. Play a 1-2 with um, Martinez, maybe? Oh, no. Done a bit too much there, Martinez. Still got the ball, though. Foden. Oh, that's a great turn from Foden. Slide that one through. Can we cross it in? Lovely ball. Martinez at the back post. Gonna bring Shelby on for Samar. Bring on some fresh legs in the midfield. Samar getting the first goal of the game. Having a decent game. Ball whipped in. Martinez is there. De La Vega's gonna be able to get this one. Should be a free kick, but it's not. Not really got many options here. So Maxim is in here though. Gonna scoop that. Oh, that's lovely. For... That's given a penalty. He's given a penalty. I I'm surprised because I've never seen a penalty being given for a player that hasn't gone down. Wow. Okay then. Um, we're gonna hopefully go further in in front now. I'm gonna go let's try and go to the top corner here with Martinez. Oh no, that's that's really wide. Oh no. Oh, we've scored. I got lucky there. I had to change back down to the middle um, with Martinez there. But it's 3-1. That should be game over now. Latour Martinez getting another goal this season. I'm going to bring Atsu on for the last bit of the game. Um, give um, Almiron a break. Latour Martinez scoring the penalty. We're now 3-1 up against Wolves. Here come Wolves. Deep into 
the um, second half now. And Kilo's got quite a lot of space to run into here. Just waiting for De La Vegas to maybe make a run ahead of me, which he has. That's a great play. Should be able to cut inside now. Manquilo is there. Martinez is there for the hat-trick. Martinez! And it's 4-1. In the last minute of the game, Martinez gets his hat-trick. He is on fire today in this episode. And to be fair, this season, um, that should be game. I don't really... Oh, I'm going to make the sub. Oh, I was going to make the sub anyway, but um, that should be game over now. Well, that is game over. 4-1. And that is the full-time whistle. Lovely, lovely win for Newcastle there. Martinez getting the hat trick. We're going to move on into the next game against Chelsea. Right then, guys, we're moving on into the biggest game of the episode so far against Chelsea at home. Hopefully, we can um, pull off an upset here. Now, we've moved up to about 7th or 6th, I, I do believe. Um, we will check that at the end of the episode. But I, Chelsea are 4th or 5th right now. So we are chasing them in the table. So hopefully we can uh, try and pull off an upset here. Let's see how we get on. Martinez plays a nice ball down to De La Vega. Gonna play that inside to Almiron. Oh, I was trying to play it back to De La Vega. Too slow there. Um, this um, shadow on the pitch is not helping me at all, by the way, with the kit we've got on. Um, anyway, Martinez. Oh, he plays St. Maxim in. St. Maxim. Oh, my God. That's a great tackle from... Um, Palacio, I think that was someone. I don't know who that is. Um, but it was a great tackle. That's not a good tackle. Um, so Chelsea having most of the ball, as we would expect at the start of this game. Lovely tackle from De La Vega there. I'm going to switch this one to Somar. I didn't even see that Chelsea player. That's the thing. Martinez. Can we slide him in? Somar? No. Here come Chelsea now. Jorginho with the ball. Running into the box. Pulls it back. Shot is off. Oh my god, what a save to Bravka. And Naki Williams there with the shot. And um, Pedro with the corner now. Can we get rid of it now? Let's go. Head up. There's a good one from Shah. It's only as far as Jorginho. Now we can actually counter attack here. The only player forward is Martinez. Uh, couldn't keep the ball there. And here come Chelsea of Pulisic. Lays it back. Jorginho to Kovacic. Still going here, Kovacic. Pedro, Jorginho's in. It's getting dangerous. Good tackle from Konate. We can counter-attack here. Play out to St. Maxim on the wing. Oh, we've got a load of players forward here. Martinez is through. He's quicker than Christiansen. Gonna lay it back. Oh, this is a lovely play. Why have we slowed down? De La Vega now. Still a chance. And he scored. What a finish that is. Oh, my days. I couldn't even tell because of the sunlight. What a goal that was. Lovely ball. It does kind of slow down here, but we could make a touch. Emerson, I think that was, trying to dive in. And what a finish that is from De La Vega. 1-0 up against Chelsea. Martinez now on the ball. Slides it through to Almiron. He gives it to Foden. Oh, couldn't get around Christiansen. Good defending from him. And here come Chelsea on the counter-attack. Somar, lovely little bit of play to get the ball back. Martinez, Almiron. Lovely ball. Plays it past Rudiger. Martinez, it's 2-0 against Chelsea. Would you believe it? 2-0 in the first half. We're absolutely cruising in this game now. Lovely goal again. Almiron and Martinez linking up perfectly to get the goal. How many goals is that for Martinez? 12 Premier League goals this season. 2-0 against Chelsea. Let's see if we can carry that in to the second half. Here come Chelsea. Willian is through and it's a goal. 2-1. Gonna bring Shelby on for Foden. And it's 2-1 now. Chelsea getting an equaliser. Not really what you want to see, but we are still in the lead, so there's no need to panic. Here comes Della Vega now on the wing. Pushed off the ball. Should be our throw-in though. Don't really have many options here. Somar coming across. Here's Almiron. Shelby. Martinez is through here. Martinez going to get the goal. Kepa with a great save. Going to fall to no one, unfortunately. And Chelsea can get it away. Oh, that's a great run from De La Vega. The defender has done enough, but he's kicked it out for a throw-in. Deep in the Chelsea half now. De La Vega's on the short. Somar is there. 
I have to try and find Martinez. Can you clip back? Somar. He has to finish it and he does. It's 3-1 against Chelsea. What is happening? Somar with a lovely finish. Him and Martinez getting the goals again. Back-to-back -back games, they've both been the goal scorers. Lovely play from Newcastle. It's 3-1 now. Let's see if we can just hold this lead out. Martinez and Almiron linking up really well. Oh, Almiron's giving the ball away. Chelsea trying to play out from the back, which is kind of working for them. But we go, oh God, look how much pressure we gave there. Couldn't get the ball back. Willian now on the ball. Jorginho all the way over to Oliveira. Ball's whipped in. Shaw. Oh, my God. Danny Rose, what are you doing? Oh, my God. Danny Rose has just fallen over Shaw. What are we doing at the back there? That's awful defending. Let's take another look. Look, Danny Rose, why is he chesting it? I'm spamming square to head it out. Oh, we've conceded here. And hopefully, well, I'm just going to try and keep the ball for the last 10 and hold the game out to Maximan. Martinez needs some help here. Oh, no, he's giving the ball away. Didn't really need to be doing that here. Willian now on the attack. Eugenio. I can let them just play it around with, with the ball. I don't really need to um, push men forward. We've got them kind of pinned in here. But now the gaps are starting to show. Here come Chelsea. It's about four minutes left of this game. Danny Rose. Oh my god. Again, I'm spamming like X or square for him to head that out and he doesn't do it. Um, bit annoying, but here he is now. Martinez. Oh, wait, what is that? Pedro now. Kovacic. Kante. Chasing the ball down with Somar. We've not got long left. Literally an out of time. We can't be conceding now. Here comes Kante. We're going to do cut inside. No one's marking Pedro. Anaki Williams. Konate, what are you doing? Get rid of the ball. And it's over and wide. What a game that was. 3-2 to the Newcastle United. Let's go. What a win that was. That pushes us up the table, I do believe. Anyway, we're going to move into the last game of the episode against Everton. Right then, guys. We've got a transfer offer here for Hayden. We're going to go into the negotiations with Sevilla. They offered about 7.1 million. I'm going to try and get a bit more for that. I feel like he's worth a bit more. Again, he's one of these players that I literally don't use. I know he's he's, still, he's not that young. Um, what I'm going to say is maybe 12 million. Uh, I'm going to ask for 12 million. Let's see if, what they say to that. Uh, submit that offer. They might say it's too much. Wow, they don't. They really don't want to... Um, let's, let's just go to 10. Let's, let's try 10. Because that is what he's valued at. Okay, let me, how about if I just counter that, remove that, and then do 9 million. Let's see if we, they'll take the 9 million. Okay, 9 million, there we go. So, that is that done. Now we have to wait and see what happens for that. Anyway, we're going to jump into the last game of the episode. Right then, guys, jumping into the last game of the episode. We're against Everton, away from home. Big game here. We're three points behind Chelsea, I do believe, from what I just checked. Or two points behind. I think it's three. Uh, they're sat in about fifth. And we're sat in sixth right now. So a win here would boost our confidence. Uh, to push up the table. Let's see how we get on. Need some options though. Over ahead of me. Still not many options. Oh, De La Vega's made the run now. Can he find the man inside? Yes he can. Miguel Almiron. And it's in. It's 1-0. 20 minutes in. And we're already 1-0 up. Almiron getting his... Uh, I don't even know how many goals he scored this season. That's got to be about six now. For Almiron, let's see how many he's got. Eight goals in the Premier League this season from a cam. And to think, we were playing them out wide on the right-hand side. Um, the start of the season, he was awful for us. Ever since we put him into the cam role, he's been absolutely amazing. Let's see if we can carry this on. Martinez to uh, Almiron there. Good pass from him. Can we find Martinez? Why is he trying to play it to De La Vega? We should win the header here with Danny Rose. Uh, who's going to pick that up? Martinez. Of course it's Martinez. Almiron. We cut that one back. Foden's there. Oh, I just couldn't get it through to him. Approaching half time. We want to keep this lead before we go into the, the half time break. Or oh, we could add to it here. Phil Foden bursting through. Going to cut inside. Does the defender. Oh, he's put it wide. No. How has he missed there? Here goes St. Maxim on the wing. 
Gonna wait for some support. Almiron. Oh, this is, this is Almiron on the ball. Waits for Martinez's run. Martinez is through on goal. Has to finish. And he does. It's game over, surely. 2-0 now. Martinez getting another goal this season. The man can't stop scoring at the moment. They're gonna bring an Atsu for the last 10 or so minutes. We're tuned them up, and that should be game over. Atsu got a lot of space out wide for St. Maxim, who's gonna drive in into the box. Alan St. Maxim, can he finish it? Oh, what a save from Pickford. And I was oh, I was trying to go for the finesse shot, open up his body, but it, it didn't really work, so that's why he's kind of just shot it straight at Pickford. And that is game over. What a win for Newcastle. 2-0 away from home to Everton. And that is going to wrap up the gameplay for this episode. But we are going to jump into the table just before we do end the episode off. What an episode that was. Chelsea winning 3-2. So they are still above us in the table. Liverpool also winning. Spurs drawing because I know they're sat around 4th as well. That kind of helps us. So what we're going to do now... Um, is head over. I know we got the FA Cup fourth round, which we'll play in next ep in the next episode. Um, we are going to go and have a look at the um, the table. That's so around four: Sheffield United, Everton, Newcastle, Oxford, Wigan, Accrington, Man United, and Fulham. Um, Blackburn, Norwich, Liverpool, Reading, Watford, and Colchester all still in. Uh, also, you got all of these teams as well. Um, there's a lot of lot of teams left in that competition. Um, so I need to just try and find the Premier League table now, which is a bit annoying. Um, to find, which is, like I said, annoying, but um, here we go. So we're sat sixth right now. Oh, wow. Okay. So we've really pushed up the table. Um, so we're sat on 45 points, Chelsea on 48, Spurs on 50. So we're only five points off the top four. Um, so for the next episode, like I said, we're going to play against Oxford in the FA Cup. And then what we're also going to play, if I can find that on the calendar, is obviously Norwich. Arsenal, Crystal Palace and Burnley to finish off February and then we move on into the next month which we'll probably play uh, in the following episode depends um, how how well we do in February anyway um, we are going to leave this for the next episode um, like I said leave me some transfer suggestions in the comments down below again we've not got much money anything between like 0 to 20 million 25 million because we do have um, someone selling uh, Hay Hayden might be uh, getting sold so let me know in the comments any suggestions. Make sure to leave a like on the video. Subscribe if you're new around here. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.